Creating a published job in Domo is easy. This powerful tool allows you to quickly share pages, cards, and datasets with customers, vendors, or partners in a secure hosted Domo environment, while allowing you to control what they see through filtering tools. Let's get started. First, navigate to the dashboard you wish to publish. Next, select the Share option, clicking on Publish from the drop-down menu to begin the process. You can also begin the process in the Admin Settings section. If you use this approach, select Publish, then Publications. Next, select New Publication. Either approach will lead you to the Publication Creation page. Here, your first step is naming the publication. Select a name that easily identifies the purpose and content of the publication. You can also use the description section to document the content that is being published and the target recipients. Select Next. The next step is adding subscribers. You will need to know the URL of the subscriber's domain. The format for the domain is publisher-subscriber.domo.com. For example, stravello-speedcycles.domo.com. For your convenience, subscribers that have been added to previous publications will appear in a list as options for easy selection. Click Next. Then, select the page or pages you want to publish. Please note, the pages you select must have been shared with the user configuring the published job. Choose Next. The next step is reviewing the datasets that power the dashboard. The toolkit will automatically select datasets that are required to power the published visualizations but you can also add additional datasets if desired. When ready, click Next. Now you will set the data permissions. This leverages PDP. By default, the All Rows policy name will be selected. If you desire the content to be filtered, you can select the Include in Publication box for the relevant PDP policy. For your convenience, you can create new policies with the Add Permission button, or add existing policies listed by hitting the Edit Policy button. One policy must be chosen for each dataset, whether that is all rows or a more restrictive policy that was previously created or created during this step. When all of your datasets have policies, select Next. Time to review your publication. Review the final information before saving to confirm that the number of pages, cards, and datasets are as expected. If satisfied, click Save. Please note, this will make the publication available for subscription in subscriber instances. Subscribers will still need to accept the invitation before any content appears. Now that you have successfully published your content, the subscriber will have real-time access to the data as it is in your Domo environment, and there's no need to refresh the data to the subscriber. However, you may have need to update the visualizations being shared. When this happens, you will need to refresh the publication for the updates to appear in the subscriber instance. To refresh, Make sure you've made all the changes you want to propagate to the subscribers, then navigate to Publish in the admin settings of the Publisher instance. Select Publications, then identify the publication that needs to be refreshed. Hover over the publication, then select the wrench icon that appears on the right-hand side. Select Refresh from the top-down menu. It's important to note that we want to make sure no changes are being made to the included visualizations while the refresh is taking place. You can also delete a publication from the same menu. Please note, this will immediately start the process of removing the included pages, cards, and datasets from the subscribers. With your dashboard published and shared, subscribers can now accept the subscription to be published in their own instance. That process is explored in a separate video. As you can see, creating and managing subscriptions is easy with Domo Publish.